this week, 12 Republican senators voted against Donald Trump. They didn't just vote against him on something easy or on something unimportant. No, 12 Republican senators voted against Donald Trump on his signature campaign promise, the border wall that is still so popular with his base. This is significant because this is a clear sign that at least 12 GOP senators are sick of Donald Trump and will vote against him if they think they can get away with it politically, and they clearly do think they can get away with it. It just takes eight more Republican senators willing to vote against Trump to get to the magic impeachment number. Eight may sound like a lot of additional Republican senators to get to vote against Trump, and it is, but there are surely more than eight who are secretly sick of Donald Trump and would love to get his toxic and sloppy criminal family out of the White House and out of the Republican Party. That means now is the time to release the Mueller report or to release enough solid evidence that Trump and his family are guilty of high crimes and begin impeachment. With nearly two years still left before the 2020 elections, Republican senators could vote to oust Trump now, and in their mind they will have time to change the narrative of the 2020 elections and make it about something other than Trump. If the impeachment process does not begin within the next five months, Republicans will argue that the process is a political stunt to hurt their chances in the upcoming elections, and they will be less likely to vote against Donald Trump if he is still popular with the Republican base. If impeachment has any chance of succeeding, the vote needs to take place before Republican senators begin campaigning for their own re-election.